Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and good evening to all the Beretta tribers that share with us the same passion for the outdoors and hunting that stands at the core of Beretta's soul for 500 years. Thank you for being with us tonight. I am Luisa Aquino. I am the brand communication manager at Beretta, and I'm super honored and excited to be your host tonight. I'm also a little bit anxious because I know we are finally ready to experience together a new important chapter of our relationship with you, our valued customers, our business partners, our media partners, and all of our colleagues. Tonight, despite all the difficult events that have characterized the past months, we are here ready to celebrate the new upcoming hunting season and for the very first time, we are doing this all together, united, live. As you can notice, there is a box at the bottom of your screen where you can communicate with us by asking questions or leaving your comments. Please participate and help us sensing how big is the Beretta tribe. We will answer all of your questions later in this show from the same stage. And for those questions that might not fit, we will come back to you in the next days. Now, we have been announcing this event for three weeks. We have been intriguing you, showing you empty skies, showing you scared, small game, watching out for the arrival of a new predator. And here we are, finally, ready to discover together what stands behind the beauty of a perfect shot. Yet, before doing this, uh, I'm very honored to leave this stage uh, to our president and CEO, Mr. Franco Gustali Beretta, 15 generation of the Beretta family, a passionate and committed leader, super convinced that the challenge of his generation is to bring Beretta into the digital era. Live from our headquarters in Gardone Valtrompia, the Beretta Villa, Mr. Franco Gussalli Beretta. Good evening, everybody. Uh, thank you for being here with us uh, tonight. We talk about digital. Digital has been a big game changer for all of us uh, lately and will continue to be. At Beretta, we are an industrial manufacturing company. And since a uh, long time, uh, we have invested heavily and uh, to take advantage of the digital uh, tools. Uh, digital for us means uh, in R&D uh, a new way of uh, uh, developing the new product. Since uh, the 80s, uh, we have uh, introduced uh, the CAD that has allowed us uh, to develop uh, uh, further our incredible product. Manufacturing. Uh, manufacturing first with the CNC machinery and then uh, nowadays with Industry 4.0 is uh, uh, the new game changer because uh, we can produce our amazing product always in a more competitive uh, price that naturally is of paramount uh, importance. After R&D and manufacturing, uh, we have uh, QC that is of paramount importance because we want to uh, deliver to you the best product possible, the most reliable. We have introduced uh, uh, very sophisticated equipment like the tomography, to uh, have uh, the best analysis and very uh, fast of our components, of all our material, inside and outside. Lately, we have introduced also artificial intelligence, artificial intelligence that allow us to analyze all the veneers of the wood to choose the best for you. But uh, where digital is really bringing big change, dramatic change is uh, in the digital marketing. For Beretta, marketing is always very important in both directions, to receive information from you guys, uh, our value customer and our partner out in the field, and to give you better information. So uh, today with the digital marketing in all these uh, different way, the social network, uh, using uh, better our customer database to send you email, uh, etc. We want to put you really in the front row seat of uh, uh, a virtual presentation. So 
to establish a, a great relationship with you so that our expert here in Gardona and throughout the world can really in, uh, introduce you to all our exciting uh, great new products. The relationship uh, with you, uh, our value customer and uh, uh, our uh, uh, partner around the world has always been of paramount importance in Beretta. I want to just remember a few points. Uh, my great grandfather at the end of the 19th century, he was already traveling around uh, uh, the larger Europe, so from North Italy to Turkey, to uh, have a direct contact with his customer. And he uh, realized, he built an incredible warehouse that we now call a museum to welcome his customer here in Gardone with his, uh, to present his product. And uh, the decoration of uh, the uh, warehouse was incredible just to welcome uh, his value customer. Today, we use this warehouse as our uh, museum. After that, my great uncles, after the war, they established sister company around the world to again being in much more close contact with our customer. My father continued this great project of establishing the sister company and he opened the most important one, the Beretta USA, to have direct access to the very important market in the US. After that, he thought that to display his great product around the world, he needed a, a flagship store. And so he decided to open a few galleries in the main city of the world to really present uh, our amazing uh, new product around the world with the Beretta Gallery concept. Now we are in the digital area, so uh, we want to be more and more close uh, to you because we want to make sure that uh, we are able to provide you the emotion for your next perfect shot. Thank you, Mr. President. It's always inspiring to listen from your own words how Bretta managed to evolve from a pure firearm manufacturer into a digital outdoor brand. But now it's time to focus on the very special reason why we are here tonight, the beauty of a perfect shot. Let's move in a sort of reverse process and try to understand what's behind how does Beretta operate in order to deliver you a perfect shot? To do this, I'm very pleased to welcome on this stage our general manager, Mr. Carlo Ferlito. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. It's a real honor for me to be here this evening to introduce you to the new Predator. There is a new predator in the air. That's what probably the Chinese uh, have thought when they've discovered the existence of COVID-19 virus. The virus is true. It has affected our lives, changed for good the world that we're living in. But so what? Has change never happened before in our lives? Is our world still an immutable? We perfectly know that everything is in perpetual movement, in continuous evolution. Anthropy is always growing, and that's the reason why time flies only in one direction, the future. So the only wise option that we have is to thrive on change in order to be successful in the future. But to do that, uh, some virtues are needed. Resilience, adaptability, willingness to embrace change, Innovation. I think today's event is a perfect example of change. Is this event an emergency system in order to present a product that cannot be introduced in person because of the COVID restrictions? I don't think so. This uh, type of technology is going to stay, is the new normal. Digitalization made this possible, as it made possible to our great uh, company, Beretta, a resilient, adaptable, open to change, innovative organization to continue to operate with success. 
thanks to digital technology and remote connection, our R&D team has kept working nonstop during the severe lockdown that this area of the world suffered in 2020. And we, they continue to develop new ideas, new technologies, new products in order to build up the future of our company, our industry, but also of our sport and our passion. If I have to pick up one aspect that made this company thrive for almost 500 years through wars, uh, economic and political turmoils, uh, natural disasters, in one world through change, is the R&D effort. We believe in innovation. We believe uh, in new ideas, in new solutions, in new technologies, either on existing products, uh, evolving them, or on new products. And this is the only way to serve the, uh, the future and uh, generate uh, added value for our customers all over the world. Shortly, you will see the new Predator, a product that provides uh, continuity and growth to a great class of firearms of ours in the never-ending chase of the perfect shot. But I can assure you that the great individuals that are working in R&D, quality manufacturing, all over the planet for this great brand are completing and finalizing additional new projects, new products that will hit the market soon in the next weeks, months, and years to come. But now it's time to fly into the future. Wow. Welcome, Beretta Tribe. Welcome, everybody, at the Lynch Digital Lounge of the Civil Prison Free. My name is Roberto Zarrillo. I'm the Business and Product Development Manager at Beretta. I'm very glad to introduce you Riccardo Olivieri, Product Manager for Competition and Hunting, that together with more than 30 people, developed such a beauty, Silver Pigeon Free. Hello, Ricky. How are you today? Very good, Roberto. I hope. Uh... All of you enjoyed the video. It was uh, very fun. It really, you can get the feeling what it's going to haunt, see your dog working, the pheasant. Just an amazing experience just to get out of the city and enjoy our passion. Great. Tell me more about this shotgun. What was the main goal, the purpose is, uh, when you were building such a wonderful gun? Well, Roberto, as you know, uh, try to build or improve something that was almost perfect already is very difficult. In this case, uh, the 680 series is a legendary gun. Probably most hunters around the world knows about it. 
But uh, when it comes to what you're looking on a gun, usually for me and from all that I've learned around the world with many hunters, it boils down to just a few things. Reliability, how is uh, shooting this gun, so the comfort while shooting the gun, and the other one is the aesthetics. At the end of the day, we're buying something that needs to be beautiful, work perfectly, and be very super reliable. And more, what is exactly the legendary reliability of the Beretta shotgun? What is the promise that we can do to our Beretta tribe hunter? So uh, the legendary reliability comes basically to the center part of this gun. It's the receiver. It's a proprietary patented receiver developed by the Beretta team uh, a few decades ago, but nevertheless, this gun has been in constant improving and perfection through all the time. And this is just the latest, let's say, uh, iteration of this perfectionism that we're always trying to look on the guns. So we can say the receiver on this kind of gun, uh, I can say very confident that you can shoot probably 100,000 rounds without major issues on the gun. So that's uh, pretty impressive. Just to give you an idea, 100,000 guns should be half a cargo container in, in size. Also, the machines and uh, let's say the technology that we use to manufacture all the bits and pieces of the gun and the quality control that we have. We even have a, a thermography machine, an X-ray machine, just to see that inside the metal doesn't have any flaws. So it just needs to get out of the factory in perfect shape. Great, so it's just not a promise of reliability, but durability. It's a shotgun that possibly you buy and you can provide as it is to your son and to your grandson. Correct. We saw in the video the perfect shot. Of course, we cannot be at the place of the hunter, but how we can help the hunter to get a perfect shot? Well, uh, in this case, uh, the perfect shot, obviously, we're talking about the barrel. The barrel technology that we have on this kind of gun is uh, the best that you can find right now on the market. We have a huge team of Beretta shooters from all around the world that every time we try to develop something, help us with these kind of products. These uh, professional shooters, most of them have won many uh, medals at the Olympics or countless world championships, help us develop what is the technology that later, st first we start on the competition side, obviously, and then at some point we translate all that super high-tech technology and uh, things and expertise that we have on the competition side onto the hunting. In this case, the barrel technology, it's probably, in my opinion, the most important to do the perfect shot. Obviously, uh, we have hammer forged barrel of stelium technology, which is the process of, and the technology of how Beretta makes these barrels, which are perfectly centered, uh, both barrels are shooting always at the same time, plus we have a proprietary steel, in other words, the recipe of this steel, it's made only for Beretta and for these kind of barrels. And there's also a purpose of why we do that. Great. Uh, of course, uh, uh, we are Italian, the beauty is uh, uh, in our DNA. What was uh, the topics, uh, what was uh, exactly the point that makes uh, this uh, shotgun uh, the most beautiful shotgun at this price point? Well, when it comes to a hunting shotgun here, of course, we already talked about the reliability, thousands and thousands of shots that you can do. But in this case, the most important things, in my opinion, are the wood quality that we have on the gun plus the engraving. If it comes to the wood, basically, uh, we have a 2.5 grade walnut wood uh, with a special uh, surface treatment that actually protects this kind of wound and also enhance, let's say, the, the, the vein of this kind of wood, which is becoming more rare to find year by year. The other uh, very important thing that we have, and it's a, it's a new addition, and it's uh, the latest iteration of our laser technology that we have on the gun. Here, uh, in this case, we try to combine the effect of uh, the traditional hand engraved, still done by laser, and also the accuracy and the, let's say, the good things about laser engraving. So we combine both of them in this kind of gun, so the receiver and the result is just astounding. So if you walk into a store, you will see this gun standing out in front of you, calling for you to buy it. Great, great. Uh, last question. When will you be the next, uh, your next hunting trip? Well, for sure, uh, in Italy, hunting season starts at the end of September, so the first day the hunting season opens, I'll be there. And what if, if, you, if you could do that with your new Silver Pigeon 3? 
Well, uh, I think I will. That's what I want. Riccardo, Roberto, thank you for this amazing presentation. I'm super excited for the beauty of this new Silver Pigeon 3. And I hope everyone at home is the same excited as we are here. But I know that someone in UK had the lucky chance to be the first to test this gun in the field. And I'm really, really pleased to welcome here with us tonight Mr. Carl Vaktare, Managing Director of GMK. And I know, Carl, that you are there with two important guests. Yes, uh, thank you, Louisa, for inviting us to be part of this. Yes, I've got two um, renowned shooting journalists in the UK, from the UK here. I've got Mike Yardley, who's a sportsman and firearms writer, and I've known him personally for many years, and he's written for all, all of the UK shooting magazines. And Johnny Carter, who's a presenter with TGS Outdoor, and also does some great um, video reviews on guns, and he's very much the new breed. So, um, Mike, what were your impressions of the gun? Hi, Carl. Well, this is the latest version of one of the most successful over and unders ever conceived. More than a million units of the 6.8 series manufactured, itself a gun that evolved out of the models 55 and 56 in the old days. It's an extraordinary gun. It's distinguished by a low profile action, bifurcated lumps, that means a split hinging pins with trunnion hinging, conical locking bolts, an excellent, well-proven design, the Beretta monoblock, extremely strong. And it's a gun that has proven almost indestructible in use, which is why so many shooting schools use it um, in the UK. I mean, you, you go to their gun racks and you'll always see silver pigeons there. This gun is the latest version, and it's the prettiest version yet, with some really nice new laser engraving. And as well as that, there's an improved stock finish. The grain's particularly um, well filled. The stock finish is a little bit shinier than it was in the past. It, it's not bright and glossy, but, it, it, but it's, um, it's, it's different and it's better. And the general aesthetics of the gun have been improved. And that's a hard thing to do when you've had a gun in production so long, to actually make it noticeably better. And Beretta have succeeded with that. In addition, the gun shoots fantastically. It shoots really well. Um, felt recoil is low. The gun is easy in use, consistent, forgiving in use, and it's an ideal all-round gun. Although it's designated a field gun, you can shoot clays with it, and it would be an ideal choice for perhaps someone who was going to upgrade from their first gun and was looking for something a bit better that would last them forever if they wanted. It's also a good gun for anyone, whatever your level of experience, because it's a silver pigeon and it's virtually indestructible and it's future-proof too, you know, steel shot friendly multi-choked, it's a do-anything gun, and it's a really excellent gun at a reasonable price. Yeah, thank you, Mike, yeah. And, and Johnny, how, how, I see you're standing there with the gun. How did you get on with it? So for me, Carl, I was a little bit worried, actually. The Silver Pigeon 3 original was one of my favorite Berettas. So to try and re-bring it out, I was kind of a little bit skeptical. However, when I brought it out of the box, the laser engraving is just much better than the original. They've nodded at original style engraving, but they've really taken this down a different route, and it is a stunning gun that needs to be seen to be appreciated. On top of that, the new wood finish looks better, it's deeper, it's nicer, but more importantly than all of that, for me, is it's set up a lot more like a modern sporter, which suits the modern sportsman, suits the modern hunter, because we're all coming into hunting through clay shooting. It's set up with a higher comb, it swings and handles a little bit more like a sporter. It is a beautiful modern hunting field gun. I really, really like it. And the final thing for me is that it's the same price now as it was 10 years ago when it stopped existing. And it's very rare that you get more for less money nowadays. And I think this really is, uh, is a really good example of that. It's a great gun that is not expensive. Fantastic. Thank you. Well, thank you guys um, for taking the time to be here and um, hope you enjoy the season and that um, things, things move forward from here. Thank you. Thank you, Carl. Thanks for asking me. It's been a lot of fun. And mm -hmm. I thought Johnny made a very good point. It's a very good value gun. Not all guns are good value today. This one is. It looks pretty, it shoots well, and it's excellent value. A lot of bang for your buck. I love what you say, Mike and Johnny. It's fantastic. So basically, it shoots fantastically. It looks great. 
and is a perfect all-round gun at a reasonable price, the same that it was 10 years ago. So thank you, guys. I can't wait to see your entire review on your media. And uh, I will be pleased to see you later, Carl, to discover all what you are catering for the UK people by the end of the month. See you later. See you. Thank you. And now we are ready to, to move into another chapter of the story tonight. And I want to spend a few seconds just to share with you what was our experience when we were working internally to decide how to launch this new Silver Pigeon Free. Of course, as we do normally, we have been uh, uh, briefing uh, internally and externally with our uh, closer users. And we were asking everyone, so but why should you buy a Silver Pigeon Free? What is the promise we can deliver with this gun? And after listening to many interesting stories, we understand a core fact that is related to the Silver Pigeon platform, and is this fantastic concept of the perfect shot. What is a perfect shot? We understood tonight, thanks to Carlo Ferlito and uh, our valuable journalists in UK, a sort of reverse of what stays behind, how do we manufacture, develop first, and then manufacture and deliver a tool, a machine that can shoot perfect shots. But now we want to move into another dimension that is one of your real experience. When we are out in the field hunting, what are those memorable moments, feelings, when we got the perfect shot? And to help us share in this story, we want to start with uh, some of our closest field tester and user. I'm really happy to welcome here Claire Zetz from UK. Hello, Claire, good evening. Hi. And Philibert Camus, Food Chasse, your Instagram profile, recently joined the Beretta Tribers team. Good evening, Philibert. Good evening. Bonjour, bonjour à tous. <laughs> We have a little bit of delay. You have to imagine that all these guests are live connected from different parts of the world. So thank you for all the uh, direction behind the scene that is making all this possible. So challenge. It's not easy to explain in words, but I'm sure, Claire, that uh, you can help us get into the understanding of what the perfect shot is to you. And before doing that, maybe you would like to share in a few words for the few people that probably don't know you yet. What is your story as a huntress? Uh, yeah, thank you. Um, well, hello, my name's Claire. I'm based over in the UK. Um, I have been shooting since I was a tiny girl. Uh, I learned from my dad. Uh, we are passionate and I have grown up in an environment of a field to fork lifestyle. So going out, sourcing your own food, whether that be venison, whether that be pheasant, partridge or pigeon. Um, and so I have shot for quite a long time and I'm very active within the shooting community back in the UK. Fantastic. Thank you, Claire. So, Claire, I stay with you. Um, get us on board. What is your feeling? You were very excited when we shared the campaign with you. You said you really got the meaning of this. What is a perfect shot to you? The perfect shot for me is the culmination of all those exciting and passionate parts of a day in the field that you might be out with friends and family, you have that excitement building from the first thing in the morning, your dogs are ready, maybe you've been working throughout the close season with training your dog and you're finally ready like I was last season to take uh, my Labrador Woody out for his first day in the field. You've been honing your skill, you have been honing your field craft and then that point comes where it's the accuracy, the reliability in your shotgun, in your capabilities, comes together with a perfect shot that's witnessed by everybody. Maybe not witnessed, maybe only just by yourself, but you feel that sense of achievement and sense of pride. And then at the end of the day, you can take home your quarry, you can take home your, your food, cook a meal, and uh, share your stories about the days hunting with whoever you're cooking for, and family and friends, and that for me, it's really what captures the perfect shot and why I got so excited about this campaign. Fantastic, Claire, fantastic. So it is really all the preparation before, all the result of the action afterwards. Yeah. Thank you for sharing this. And let me ask you the same, Philibert, if you first uh, can tell us a little bit uh, when did you start hunting. I remember you're very young, isn't it? How old are you? 
Yeah, I'm uh, 21 and I uh, started to hunt uh, since I'm uh, three years old. Uh, I love it. I uh, hunt in the old French uh, regions, uh, which are all very different. Uh, I hunt uh, with my uh, young dog, uh, Springer, uh, um, per day. And, uh, and I really love it and I'm, I'm really happy to be part of this uh, adventure. Uh, and it's a real pleasure to be here and um, thanks to Beretta to uh, help me during my, my uh, different hands and, uh, and yes, that's it. Thank you, Philibert. We are happy to be with you in your hands, absolutely happy of that. So tell us, what is your point of view? What is a perfect shot to you? Um, above all, a perfect shot is a, is a memor memorable shot, sorry. Um, you can remember that moment because of uh, the place, because of the person you were with, um, but you can also remember it uh, because of the gun you were able to shoot with. It. Um, it is for me also the kind of uh, shooting uh, you do and you say to yourself right uh, afterwards, I hope somebody saw it, otherwise nobody will believe me. And um, that is for me a, per a perfect shot. And uh, as Claire uh, said, it's a combination of, uh, of different things that uh, make you remember this moment uh, during uh, weeks, during months, during years. And um, that, uh, that is for me uh, the definition of a perfect shot. I love it. Thank you, Philibert. Fantastic. So there is something we want to share with all our Beretta tribers uh, around the world, in Europe basically, because you have a surprise for them. You accepted to play with us and to do something very special in the next weeks uh, and month, isn't it, Claire? Do you want to start telling what we are ready to do? Please. Yes, exactly. Well, it feeds on from what we were just saying about what the perfect shot means to us. And what we would like to hear is from our followers and from Beretta's followers, actually, what does the perfect shot mean to them? Uh, what is the perfect shot story? What pictures do people have that just shows, that captures that moment that we were talking about, that memorable moment where everything's come together and results in just a fantastic day or fantastic point in time? And we would like our followers and Beretta's followers to share that with us, to tag uh, both my, either myself or any of my other uh, fellow um, ambassadors who are working on this launch with uh, what the perfect shot looks like to them and to share those, use the hashtag uh, perfect shot and uh, one lucky follower from each of the ambassadors will have the opportunity to be able to go and enjoy a day in the field, hopefully create some more perfect shot moments and to be able to uh, field trial the new shotgun. Fantastic, Claire, fantastic. So, Philibert, just to recap, maybe you want to say it in French, which is nice for our French audience, please. Okay, yes. Uh, donc, ce que disait Claire, c'est que euh, nous, on veut voir, euh, on veut que vous nous donniez votre définition du perfect shot. Et c'est pour ça qu'il faut euh, donc, euh, que vous nous taguiez euh, sur les réseaux en faisant une vidéo, en créant une vidéo du perfect shot. Vous nous taguiez et en fait, euh, chaque... Euh, Pour chaque ambassadeur européen, une personne sera choisie selon la vidéo de son perfect shot, sera choisie pour venir chasser avec l'ambassadeur de son pays et pour venir tester donc le nouveau 687 Silver Vision 3. Fantastic. Thank you, Philibert. So, Philibert and Claire are uh, with us tonight, but our five Beretta influencers will be participating in this challenge. Stay tuned, follow them, and follow the Brett official profile to discover more. In a couple of weeks, we will start rolling out the exact rules of the game. But uh, most of all, I really want every one of you to take a second to go back to your own personal memories, because leaving those memories again is one of the fulfillment of the pleasure we all experience about uh, hunting in this third millennium. So let me thanks again very much, Claire and Philibert, for being with us tonight. We are so excited. It's an important moment for Bretta, and it's good that you have been with us. Thank you. And we will follow you and uh, follow all the other five heroes of this uh, Perfect Shot Faces and Stories Challenge. Let's see in detail who is taking part of the challenge. Hey, everyone. It's Sam Silver Pigeon here. Follow me on Instagram for a chance to take part in the Beretta Perfect Shot Challenge.
and you may win an opportunity to come shooting with me and the brand new Silver Pigeon 687 number three. Hi, I'm Country Fred. Follow me on Instagram and take part in a perfect shot competition and uh, potentially win a chance to come shooting with me with the new Beretta 687 Silver Pigeon 3. So stay tuned. Moi, mä oon Janne. Seuraa mua Instagramissa ja osallistu samalla Perfect Shot haasteeseen. Mennään yhdessä mettälle ja kokeillaan uutta Silver Pigeon kolmosta. Nähdään. Hi guys, I'm Madeleine. I'm German hunting trophy on Instagram. Follow me and Beretta to take part in the Perfect Shot competition and also have a chance to win. Come shooting with me and the new Beretta Silver Pigeon. Good luck. Ciao a tutti, sono Luca Benzi di Alps and Shot, ti invito a venire a provare a caccia con me il nuovo Beretta Silver Pigeon 3. And now it's time to answer to all your questions. Thank you because you're posting so many questions and we have to be very fast answering. I have Roberto and Riccardo here at my side. So Javier is asking which gauges options are available? So gauges, uh, we'll have four gauges. Uh, as you know, we will have three different uh, receiver sizes, 12, 20, 28, and 410. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's great, it. Great, great. I see Ben is willing to know what other versions will become available. So we have, uh, for now, the hunting version. Eventually, we'll have also a sporter version, uh, 12 gauge and 20 gauge in the sporting version. And as I said before, four gauges for the field guns. Exactly. You already answered Freddy. The sporting version will be available soon. What else? Would be worth upgrading? Wow, I love this answer. So Thomas is asking, is it worth upgrading from a 686 uh, Silver Pigeon 1? Well, yeah. I mean, uh, especially for the price. Uh, if I, as a hunter, not as a Beretta guy, had to pay the money for a gun, it would be for sure a 686 Silver Pigeon 3. It's a much nicer looking gun. I'm not saying that the Silver Pigeon is not good, but you get all the aesthetics and the latest technology with this one, so sure. why not? Sure. Now, we have a left-handed shooter. Scott wants to know if the stock is cast off or cast in. Yes, uh, we will have both uh, left-handed and right-handed in uh, two different drops, 35-55 and 38-60. So yes, we, we have plenty of adaptability to our hunters out there. And now we go to Italy. Jacopo wants to know what are the available barrel lengths? Bar available barrel lengths will be 67 centimeters, uh, 71 and 76 for the field ver versions for now. So in Italian, 67, 71 and 76. <laughs> Fantastic. And uh, Ricardo, did we change the technology we manufacture the barrels? What is the technology? The technology we use for manufacturing all our barrels is called Stelium. In this case, uh, Stelium Optima Bore HP barrels are the one we have in this particular gun. Uh, it's, uh, let's say, the best technology that we have now available for any kind of hunting, specifically when it comes to small games like pheasants, uh, partridges, and everything. It's, uh, let's say, the best choice you can get between uh, performance and recoil managing and ballistics. Absolutely. Rudolf is asking about the chokes options. So the gun will come uh, with a very nice package, five chokes included with the gun, two are mounted, and you have three extra chokes, depending on the kind of hunting you're gonna do, so you have also plenty of flexibility. You can also shoot steel and HP steel out of any of the Silver Pigeon 3s. Fantastic. Valerie is probably fascinated by the engraving, and she wants to know more about the technology we used. So how we do the engraving, so that's kind of a secret. <laughs> But uh, basically, it's a specialized machine that uses uh, special programs to laser engraved on the receiver. And uh, we call the five axis machine, which basically you have uh, this uh, kind of robot that engraves the receiver wh while it's turning and everything. So you don't get any kind of deformation on, uh, from going from a flat surface to a round surface, which can happen sometimes when you're just trying to put something flat on a, on a curved surface. Absolutely. So that's Very quickly, a few seconds left. Uh, so what's new about the woods? If you can really say in five seconds. About the woods? <laughs> yes, what's new? The new is uh, the grade and also the finishing that we have right now on this particular one. It's a uh, much more resistant finishing than the ones we have previously, especially if you're gonna shoot in the rain in the UK or maybe in, the, in any Nordic country or anywhere in the world. The resistance to water on this particular gun is uh, very good when it comes to the wood, of course. 
And now it's like more a quiz, so drop options. How many drop options? So we have two drop options, mm -hmm. uh, a high one, 3555, and a low one, 3860, both right-handed and left-handed. And now from Miguel, a very important question, Roberto. What's the price of this gun? Possibly is one of uh, the best uh, product in terms of value for money. Uh, it starts from 2,399 euro going up, depending on uh, the different option, and of course, depending on the VAT on the different uh, countries. Of course, of course, Roberto. What about the availability in shops when oh, dealers are available? Right it? now, the 12 gauge is in the best gun shop all around the world. So go there and get ready for the next uh, hunting season. 20 gauge will be ready for the end of the year, so perfect Christmas uh, uh, gift. And uh, as well as the sporting version uh, will be available for the end of the year, so ready for the 2021 competition season. Thank you, Roberto. We have to rush. Thank you so much for all your questions. We will come back to you answering to the remaining ones, but now it's time to go back to UK with Carl. So Carl, welcome again. As we promised before, you are gonna explain us uh, what is going to happen in UK in this weekend and then in September. Yes, thank you, Louisa. Um, we, we've got uh, over 80 guns going out to dealers this uh, t tonight, Thursday night, which should be in the shops tomorrow morning for um, people to go and view. And uh, they'll be, you know, open. The shops are open this weekend for people to go, go and handle the guns. Um, we've obviously only got the 12 gauge at the moment, but um, we're looking forward to seeing the 24 and the Sporter as and when they arrive. Um, we're also going to be uh, exhibiting the gun at the Bretta World from the 11th to the 13th of September and people can come and actually shoot demonstration guns there. And um, so, so we're, that's a, another great opportunity. In terms of the um, pricing of the gun, the, the important thing is that just to convert it into sterling, because um, I know you talk Euro. So, of course. Um, <laughs> the standard silver pigeon uh, retails at 1,800 pounds, and this one's coming in at 2,250. So it's a relatively small amount of um, money for, for what we feel is a much prettier gun and um, a gun that can last a lifetime. So we're really excited. This is a, you know, you've done a great job on this gun and congratulations to the entire team. It's, um, you know, we really appreciate working so closely with you. Carl, thank you for these nice words. We are very happy about your, uh, your feedback, so positive feedback, but most of all, we will be happy to see the UK hunters, the Beretta tribers, going to the dealers this weekend and sharing their impression, their feedback on the new Silver Pigeon Free. Happy season, everyone. Thank you so much, Carl, and keep us updated from UK. We will, thank you. Not only UK, many other markets are going to receive the new Civil Pigeon 3 in the next weeks. So, to know a little bit more in detail what is going to happen and to put the final signature on this first Beretta digital event, I had the pleasure to have here at my side our sales and marketing director, Mr. Daniele Piva. Ciao, Daniele. Ciao, Luisa. And uh, hello to our valuable customers. Uh, Yes, uh, Silver Pigeon Free is uh, something of interest for many markets. Uh, tonight we had uh, with us our British friends. Uh, UK is for sure one, one of the most important markets for our uh, over 100 uh, products. Uh, but Silver Pigeon Free is uh, really something uh, that our Beretta tribers uh, will, uh, will get uh, a passion uh, from Australia to Europe uh, and uh, to US. Uh, um, Silver Prison Free is uh, something that uh, took a lot of uh, attention and focus uh, in Cyberetta from uh, uh, our R&D people and our product marketing team. Uh, we are working very hard uh, to prepare some news uh, also for the next future. I'm sure that uh, this is something uh, of uh, uh, big uh, support uh, for our partners, uh, our dealers. Uh, uh, all around the world uh, that need always uh, news uh, to, to, to develop a business. Uh, um, I hope that uh, this news uh, will be uh, successful, but most important will be probably launch uh, if this uh, new format uh, has been appreciated by our customers. Uh, 
And uh, this is the way that we do think that will be for us uh, more and more uh, consistent and effective in order to be close to you, valuable customers, to you, better drivers. And so I hope that uh, tonight uh, we are really entering in a new era of a new Beretta product launch. Fantastic, Daniele. A new era. We really feel we are entering a new era. To make this possible, a lot of colleagues have been working very hard with us. As already thanked by Mr. Carlo Ferlito, all the R&D team, all the production, of course, the demand planning, the logistic, the QC. A lot of people have been working hard, but more specifically to this event, I really want to share one second to thank the fabulous marketing team that has been preparing every single detail of this product launch. Chiara, taking care of all the web properties. Daniele, of all the social media. They are now at home, they are not with us on the stage, but I really feel they are working hard behind the scene to keep you all connected. A special thank to my sister in crime, Marta, <laughs> who made a lot of the material uh, being possible. And of course, uh, our leader, our digital leader, Alessandro, that is driving us into a new communication uh, formula. We are super happy. I uh, was asking you at the beginning of uh, this show to stay with us, to connect with us. And I have to say, Thank you, guys. You super exceeded my expectation. I'm watching the numbers, all the people connected live, and uh, this is really an encouraging first result. We are close to the end, but the story doesn't end here. I really want to tell you that uh, in order to keep the communication alive between you and us, uh, we are immediately asking you, if you want, to give us your feedback on what you saw tonight on the gun, what you like more. A survey is available for you on uh, perfectshot.beretta.com, where you will also be able to discover all the other details of this new beautiful Silver Pigeon 3 over and under by Beretta. I only want to wish you a fantastic hunting season. We are about to be ready to return on the field. We have been getting ready gearing up with all the beautiful product that uh, Beretta is providing you through the best dealers in the world and, of course, on our e-store. Stay with us. We are super happy to go on this exciting experience with you. Enjoy the beauty of a perfect shot. Good night.